husband had a baby on me and then left me for cheating. Am I the asshole? My husband and I dated for four years where we broke up a lot. During the breakups he would have other girlfriends, but I never had another boyfriend. I only wanted him. After four years we got married and had four kids together including twins. I was in bliss. I loved my husband so much. But after four years of marriage eight years together the truth started to unfold. My husband had been cheating on me our entire marriage, during our pregnancies, while I was in the hospital after giving birth to all of our children. There were at least 100 women, including his ex-wife, one night stands and a few women that were there the entire time. I was devastated but extremely trauma bonded to him and couldn't imagine life without him. He promised to change. We decided to move to another state and start over. He promised a new life. And I sure did get one. After living in the new state for nine months, I found out he had been cheating with at least four women. I told him I wanted separation but we were in a huge financial hardship at the time. I went on a few dates and quickly realized I wasn't ready. Me and him played with the idea of reconciliation and decided to reconcile. But I found out he was still cheating so we separated. He moved back to our home state and there he told me he got another woman pregnant. He begged for forgiveness begged to come back. And in my fog of emotion I allowed him back. After three months, The idea of this other woman carrying my husband's child got the better of me and I cheated for the first time in our entire relationship. I felt terrible. And I couldn't hold the secret. I admitted to my husband what I did and his whole viewpoint changed of me. For the next three years he treated me terrible. I didn't even have the friend I used to have in him. I eventually found out he continued to cheat throughout those years sometimes saying we were broken up. Sometimes not. He even cheated with one of my regulars at work. Upon finding this out we separated into different rooms in the same house. Again we are a low-income family with five kids and he has to pay child support. So it was going to take some time for him to be able to move out. He got a new girlfriend and was spending lots of time with her. I told him I was going to file divorce. When I told him that everything changed. He broke up with a girlfriend and told me he wanted to make it work. I told him what I needed in order to do that and he told me what he needed. I respected it and he did not. He ignored me for weeks at a time and when he did interact with me he was very cold and mean. He would constantly bring up me cheating three years prior but if I ever brought up his he would tell me I blame shift and don't take accountability. He would tell me he is never going to love me again and no one will. That I was worthless. We spent no time together and when we did he would act bothered and distant. By this time my mental was broken. I was depressed, suicidal. I didn't have any friends. I was in a dark place. I found solace in a male co-worker who was very kind to me. He became a friend and we soon slept together. I again admitted to my husband and told him how terrible and lost I felt. He moved out and constantly brings up how much of a slut I am and that he will never forgive me. I feel terrible. I was better than cheating but in my broken down mental state my desire to be cared about won. And now that my husband is gone, he has multiple other women, friends and a roommate and I'm here alone. I can't make friendships. I'm too beaten down to think about another relationship. I have no will. I'm so depressed and I just can't help thinking. Was this all my fault? Am I as terrible as he says I am? Am I the red flag?